Hello, in this video I am going to show you how to restore a file that has been previously backed up by Windows Backup and Windows 7. So let's start by getting into the control panel and we'll click on system and security and then backup and restore. Once we're in backup and restore we need to click on restore my files. Once we're in restore my files we can choose the link up top choose a different date and this will show us all the backups and it defaults to the last week. We could change that to the last month, last six months, or last 12 months. We only have a couple of backups in our list and we actually only want to restore a specific file. So instead of selecting a date, we're going to go ahead and just search for files or you could also browse for files. I'm going to search. I'm searching for a new file .txt. And we'll click the search button and there it is. So I'm going to check the box and click OK. And now all files will be restored to their latest version. New file.txt and we'll click on next. I can either restore to the original location which overwrites the file if it's present there or I can restore in the following location and put this in an alternate location which is what I like to do so I don't overwrite the original data I can restore a changed file and then compare the two so I'm gonna browse and I wanna restore this on the X drive and we'll click on OK and then we'll click on the restore button and it says your files have been restored so we'll click on finish and I'm gonna go ahead and close my backup and restore feature and then I'm going to go into my Windows Explorer and I want to browse the X drive and there's the new file .txt that I just restored there. So this concludes my demonstration on how to restore a file using Windows Backup on Windows 7. This is BrickHouseLabs.com and thank you for watching.